Hey guys, so uh, today we're going to be testing and just doing an experiment really on what the best wing position is in Stormworks. We're going to be testing out the efficiency of different wing styles in terms of at a certain speed, what's the most efficient, what's the most efficient at general flying, the least efficient in general flying, what's the easiest to control, what just flies the nicest, which goes the fastest, and we're just going to be seeing what that is so that you guys know that things like your career mode builds and your custom airplanes, that you know exactly what you want to do to get the most out of it. So let's start this off. Okay, so let's start talking about our efficiency at just general flying. In terms of general flying, the least efficient wing type, believe it or not, was actually low wings. And that's quite realistic considering low wings generally on planes are more designed for things like jets and stunt planes and stuff like that and fighters which guzzle through fuel but they are very agile and very quick at maneuvering. So unfortunately the low wings were the least efficient when maneuvering but when cruising our least efficient was actually our high wings and our most efficient was our parasol wings i'll put the readings up on the screen now in terms of the cruising time and the maneuvering time in terms of fuel the parasol wings as you can see here do really well and it, when you put that into an average for the average efficiency you see that actually is incredibly efficient compared to the other planes you know we've got a 6.16 for our low you know they're all chilling around six seven eight for the shoulder and then we've got a 12.5 for our parasol wings for our efficiency so the parasol wings if you're going for efficiency that is what you want this is quite similar to real world physics however some of the readings obviously aren't very realistic and like the high wings would in a real world situation probably be the second most efficient and as you move down, less efficient, but at Stormworks, we're just testing out game mechanics. Now talking about efficiency for running a plane at 15 meters per second, our best was actually our mid-wing configuration, getting 24.26, so practically speaking, that is about 24 minutes and 15 seconds on our clock for fuel time, running at 15 meters per second with mid-wings. Next, shoulder wings, parasol, high wings and low wings. So in terms of efficiency running at about 15 meters per second, our mid wings actually did best, but gradually as you speed up, it goes more and more towards the mid wings being very inefficient and the parasol wings being the best in terms of efficiency. Now for our last bit, we're gonna be talking about our top speed and how easy it is to fly. So our general flying experience. So in terms of top speed, our top speed actually goes to our parasol wings. Now you're probably sitting there going, hang on, real world physics, you'd have probably your low or your mid at higher speed. But unfortunately, Stormwind's physics doesn't allow that. So your parasol wings are your best bet for top speed. That's just what I found using this plane as a base. But in terms of top speed, parasol had a top speed of 73.4 meters per second consistently. Then we had our high wings at 72.5, our mid wings at 70.06, shoulder at 67.2, and low wings at 66.76 meters per second. So our low wings were actually our slowest. Now, in terms of flying, this is probably the big thing you want to know about because this is how your plane controls. Now this is obviously personal bias, it's personal opinion rather, because it's my flying experience, you might sit there and actually I felt that the, the agility and the quick rolling of the shoulder wings or something was better for you and that's great. But for me I found that the high wings and the parasol wings were definitely the best to control. I gave them a 10 out of 10 because they responded well and they controlled well. When you wanted them to roll or yaw or pitch, they would do that when you didn't want them to, they wouldn't. The mid wings, they were good at doing that, but the roll wasn't as well controlled. The low, even less control on the roll. Shoulder wings, unfortunately, if you put if you put the plane into a roll, it was really hard to get out of it. It was really hard to control it when banking or yawing as well. So on a particular plane like that, I would certainly not recommend shoulder. I would go for parasol, but yeah, so that's that's in terms of flying okay so we have to pick a winner because it's a competition at the end of the day we have to pick a winner in terms of our efficiency flying and general 
just being good so in terms of efficiency our efficiency at 15 meters per second obviously you'd go for mid wings but i feel efficiency all around on average our parasol wings were so much better than the others getting 17.4 at 50 meters per second and 12.57 at top speed just general flying which was really good um, considering the others were all around 8.3 to 6 um, in terms of flying it's actually also the parasol wings because they just controlled the best along with the high wings but they also had the highest top speed which means our parasol wings are definitely our winner so next time you're thinking of making that career plane or thinking of making a fictional plane or just want something for toying around with and you want it to be really efficient and really fast and really easy to control get your parasol wings because that's the best that there is guys thank you for watching and i'll uh, i'll see you in the next video goodbye